Hi, we are Lehigh University Space Initiative. We are a newly formed team from Lehigh University in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. We are excited to introduce you to our 2023 rover. Our team has 25 active members divided into five subsystems, drive, chassis, suspension or DCS, robotic arm, electrical and communications, vehicle software, and science. Even though this is our first rover, our team designed a six-wheel rocker boogie driveline system with advanced six degrees of freedom robotic arm, as well as an efficient science module. Our rover suspension system is a standard mission-proven rocker bogey and differential system. The system is constructed from water jetted quarter inch aluminum and one inch carbon fiber tubes held together by steel bolts. For our chassis, we are using 1 16th inch aluminum. This connects to the suspension through a steel differential bar and rods. Within the chassis are mounts organizing the various electrical components for our rover. For our driveline configuration, we chose to use six Rev Neo brushless DC motors. These motors are connected through Sparks Max motors controllers. The six motors give us the ability to maneuver rugged and uneven terrain. Our wheels are SLS printed out of nylon. Because of the material and inner design of our wheels, we are able to fully support the weight of the rover. The robotic arm is a six degree of freedom mechanical system comprising of three joints, with two motors at each joint, all connected by two carbon fiber tubes. Starting from the bottom, the base consists of a custom planetary gear set with three stationary planet gears and one sun gear, all driving a rotating ring gear connected to the shoulder. The shoulder has a 3D printed SLA resin part that attaches to a brushed motor with a 977 to 1 planetary gearbox and built in encoder. The following elbow and wrist joints each contain two motors for both pitch and roll movement. Connected to the wrist is the end effector, which is composed of two 3D printed grippers attached to a two output shaft gearbox that is driven by a Bring Smart 12 volt DC motor. One of the grippers includes a linear actuator, allowing for accurate pressing and screwing. Each gripper has a 3D printed TPU pad, allowing for flexible, secure clasping of various objects. For accurate and precise movement of the arm, we will be implementing inverse kinematics for easy user interface controls. Our team has developed a science module to search for the presence of life in soil by measuring catalase, an enzyme found in all aerobic life. To efficiently gather the samples, the module is equipped with a soil sample collecting system featuring swappable augers and movement in two axes. Once collected, the soil is transported to a rotable cache using a series of parasaltic pumps, ensuring precise and reliable transfer. In the cache, soil is analyzed through a custom spectrophotometer and chemical process, which first adds hydrogen peroxide to the solution. Cobalt bicarbonate is then added to induce a color change that can be measured by the spectrophotometer. Calibration curves have been developed in lab to ensure the ac accuracy of all our measurements. The science module is also equipped with a high resolution geocam and rock database, which will allow us to capture detailed images and valuable information about the potential for life. We have a 12 volt electrical system powering our main rover electronics which comprise of six Spark Max motor controllers, which power our Neo brushless DC motors for our drivetrain. We have a separate 24 volt electrical system, which powers our robotic arm, which comprises of uh, four stepper motors, two DC motors, and a servo. For rover computers, we have two Raspberry Pis and an NVIDIA Jetson, which acts as our main rover computer. All the computers are connected over a local network, and that network is connected to our base station through a Rocket M2 radio system, which allows us to control and command the rover from up to a kilometer away. As for software, we have a system which is built on top of ROS as a base for architecture and communications. We have developed a custom system to remotely distribute and recompile all rover software wirelessly over the network at the touch of a button. The base station uses a UI built in C++ with the ability to send commands, read back telemetry, and view a live camera feed. The base station is also complete with a system which pings all rover computers and the radio constantly to monitor the network health and to quickly diagnose problems. Our autonomous system comprises of several cameras able to recognize and identify Aruco tags and a LiDAR and GPS system. With these systems, we will be able to autonomously travel to coordinates, find posts, and go through gates. Our team is developing an inverse kinematic system with movement to control our robotic arm. This allows for the arm to have precise position control. Through extensive testing and vehicle systems verification, we're confident that our team will be able to excel during this year's Universe Rover Challenge. Thank you. See you in Utah.